we have to uh, understand that these people were killed. It's not they. Uh, these people, more than 400 people, right now we know uh, about more than 400 people who were killed in Bucha, who were tortured, uh, women were raped, uh, and uh, right now we collect uh, all uh, these crimes, and uh, I think that after that we, are, we shall go to the international courts. But if you speak about uh, all Ukrainian occupied territories, we have to tell about not only Bucha, it's Borodyanka, it's Chernigiv region, about Mariupol, uh, and uh, all over uh, in Ukraine uh, we have uh, a big uh, crime from Russia troops uh, on occupied territories. Do you know how many people killed in other cities like Mariupol? Now it's uh, a big bat battle. Uh, in uh, Mariupol, and uh, it's impossible to uh, understand how much people were killed. But we can tell that it's uh, hundreds and hundreds of people uh, were killed uh, in uh, Mariupol. Do you know in other cities maybe the number of the people that uh, are killed till now? We know that the 70% of uh, Chernigiv uh, were destroyed. Chernigiv was the city where live, lived uh, more than 300,000 uh, people. 80% uh, of uh, Akhtyrka uh, is uh, destroyed. Uh, it's uh, the city where lived uh, approximately 60 70,000 uh, people. Uh, the half of uh, Sumy, its oblast center, uh, it's more than 300,000 uh, people uh, lived in Sumy. Uh, half of this city were destro was destroyed. Kharkiv, uh, 40 of 40, more than 40 percent of uh, this city is destroyed by uh, Russia bombing and so so on that is why we can tell that it's a genocide of ukrainian people and uh, bucha is only uh, the uh, top of this iceberg ukrainian services select uh, some documents some uh, witnesses we collect all these documents and uh, i think that the next step is the international courts